Sabra light tank ASCOD2, an Israeli-made light tank, has arrived in the Philippines. This tank was purchased by the Philippine Army in order to modernize its tank fleet. Sabra light tank ASCOD2 is a light tank with a weight of 20 tons. This tank is equipped with a 120mm caliber cannon, 7.62mm caliber machine gun and anti-tank rocket launcher. This tank is also equipped with the Trophy Active Defense System, which can protect it from anti-tank missile attacks. The arrival of the Sabra light tank ASCOD-2 was welcomed by the commander of the Philippine Army, General Andres Centino. General Centino said that this tank will strengthen the combat capabilities of the Philippine Army. The Sabra light tank ASCOD-2 is a highly advanced tank and will provide significant capability enhancement to the Philippine Army, said General Centino. The purchase of the Sabra light tank ASCOD-2 is part of the Philippine Army's modernization program. The Philippine Army also plans to purchase medium and heavy tanks in the next few years. The Sabra light tank ASCOD-2 is manufactured by the Israeli company Elbit Systems. This tank has also been used by several other countries, including Singapore, Malaysia and Thailand. To provide a starting point for the Philippine Army's goal of rebuilding its lost armor tank capabilities, the Mechanized Infantry Division MID, has proposed the acquisition of light or medium tanks so they can relearn the operation and use of tanks. In different combat situations, the Philippine Army's light tank acquisition project was born after a long study and debate within the organization regarding whether to use heavy main battle tanks whose combat weight was between 55 to 70 tons, or light and or medium tanks whose combat weight was lighter, of 42 tons. Although plans to acquire a main battle tank still exist, MID wants to first learn from operational modern light medium tanks to determine whether the tank is suitable enough to meet their current and future needs. The Philippine Army's ASCOD-2 command vehicle also debuted at the AFP's 88th anniversary on 21 December 2023. It has Elbit Systems C2 and communications and is equipped with Elbit's UT-25 unarmed turret with 25mm autocannon. Note that the size of the UT-25 appears to have been reduced compared to those fitted to some Philippine Army M113A2S. The one on the ASCOD-2 is probably a newer variant, MK-2 or equivalent, compared to the one on the M113A2S. Elbit Systems previously confirmed to Max Defense Philippines that the UT-25's turret can actually fit a 30mm autocannon if the Philippine Army wishes to upgrade. The UT-25 is practically the same as the unloaded UT-30 turret except for the size of the gun it carries. Photo of the ASCOD-2 Sabra light tank and ASCOD-2 Command IFV seen during the AFP 88th anniversary parade yesterday, December 21, 2023. The ASCOD-2 Sabra is a combination of the GDELSA SCOD-2 tracked armored vehicle with the Elbit Systems Sabra light tank combat system which includes a 105mm gun and turret with autoloader, as well as an Elbit communications system. Meanwhile, the ASCOD-2 Command IFV uses the same platform, but with an Elbit Systems UT-25 unmanned turret with a 25mm autocannon, as well as command and control and communication systems also from Elbit Systems. Note that the vehicle has the name of the Medal of Valor recipient stenciled. Our problem here is that there are only a few MOV awardees, which will be a problem if the Philippine Army decides to acquire more ASCOD-2 Sabra tanks and IFVs in the future. This move is a change from the previous naming of Philippine Volcanoes, which was also limited by the number of volcano names to be used. Google Cloud Text-to-Speech enables developers to synthesize natural-sounding speech with 100-plus voices, available in multiple languages and variants. It applies DeepMind's groundbreaking research in WaveNet and Google's powerful neural networks to deliver the highest fidelity possible. As an easy-to-use API, you can create lifelike interactions with your users, across many applications and devices.